to you. A decades-long Baltimore tradition on display tonight. A nameless man paying tribute to Edgar Allan Poe at Poe's gravesite. WMER 2 News is uh, one of the newest reporters, Jack Watson, got a chance to experience it. He joins us now to give us his expect experience. Well, Kelly, tomorrow is Edgar Allan Poe's 214th birthday, and tonight at the church where he's buried, an eccentric tribute to Baltimore's most famous poet. Suddenly, there came a tapping. A ghostly figure out of the shadows like something Edgar Allan Poe himself would write. Flowers. Words in Latin. And a toast. A tribute to the celebrated American writer who called Baltimore home. Tracy Mathias also calls Baltimore home. She grew up a few blocks from here and has been seeing this display in some form for years. We used to hide out here at 3 o'clock in the morning. Um, and wait for the toaster to arrive. This was nice that they're continuing the tradition of this. It's been occurring since the 1940s. Back then, an anonymous man paid a yearly tribute to Poe early in the morning. That original homage ended a while back, but in recent years, dedicated local historians decided to bring back the tradition. So for several years, uh, he, nobody was doing it and it was decided to resurrect him. Jeff Jerome helped put all this together, sharing the story with the crowd here and folks all around the world on Facebook, impressed by this toaster's tribute. He's keeping it solemn, yet touching. You know, again, roses, cognac, uh, you know, speaking to, to the poets in Latin as a tribute. You gotta love it. I mean, this is just so Baltimore. And I hope it continues for many, many years. And off he goes. The bottle and the roses left behind, parting tune, then back into the Baltimore night. A ritual this crowd will remember forevermore. Well, again, it is Poe's birthday tomorrow, and the folks who brought this tribute together are planning a birthday celebration this Saturday. It can be streamed on Facebook. Kelly.